Hi guys, Beth with Hair Kabanta and Makeup coming to you with my Project Polish um, update. So this is my August update. I'm a little late, like a week late, like as always. Um, but I have some life changes and stuff like that that I have to adjust to um, in order for me to get back into like a weekly routine of putting up videos and stuff like that. I know like even then like I only put up maybe one video a week but um, so today I have a little bit of time because my husband's sleeping downstairs and the kids are being quiet for him they're just playing on their own um, so I thought I'd take advantage of this time to give an update on my project polish um, so let me start off with the polish that I finished just because I'm so excited that I finished one um, I finished up this LA Colors um, number 209 and I got this at the dollar store it's just a pink with like some little shimmers of silver silver like really really tiny little specks of silver glitter in it um, I really did enjoy it um, it's so weird though it looks like there's like product up to here and I kept using it and using it and the line didn't seem to go down I don't know why it looks like that but if I if I Pull it out and I try to get some it's just goopy and there's just like the tiniest bit that comes out um, so I'm gonna call this done um, I did put thinner in it like two or three times um, so the only reason why it there is any kind of a goop is because of that thinner um, otherwise it was all dried up and just a goop so this is done um, and that was this on the nail wheel and I'll cross that out right now um, let's see the next one, I'm so close to finishing, my goal is to hopefully finish it um, by next month, is this one, um, this is a Sally Hansen um, Diamond Strength No Chip Nail Color, and it's just like a glittery clear one, it has really um, thick glitters um, that are kind of iridescent, and then it has um, this peachy, you know, peachy clear color to it, and this is in the shade Princess Cut. Um, I do not have any progress from the last update though um, because I've been so busy what happened was I got hired as a teacher and so this is my first year teaching and I'm just so overwhelmed I have so much to do I'm teaching like four different classes and usually when you teach junior high it's like two classes and you know it's just um, maybe two grades so you only have really um, two different lesson plans for each subject so four but I have actually four classes and there's well I have six classes but five different subjects so it's it's kind of chaotic right now um, but yeah I have to do some work right now so I'm filming these right now real quick and then I'm gonna just work all day but yeah I have no progress my goal is to finish this by next month um, the next item is this um, Wet n Wild Mega Last. I only used it like once and I do have some progress. I um, Last update I was there and I'm just a little bit further down. Um, let me grab a marker so I can mark it. Hold on one second. Okay, so I marked it. Um, it's more than a little bit of progress, so I probably did wear it a few times since the last update. I just don't remember um, because the last week and a half, two weeks, I haven't worn any nail polish until today. Um, so yeah, I did make a little bit of progress on this one, so yay for that one. Um, the next one, uh, this one I have a tiniest bit of progress, but I'm not going to mark it because it's not enough to, um, to show. It's just like right under this line so with my thick pointed sharpie it's not gonna it's, it's gonna be really hard to tell so um, I'm still you know just a little bit below that line um, so I'm wearing that shade today it's the Sally Hansen's Hard as Nails um, Mighty Mango um, so yeah I like this on my toes not so much on my fingernails um, but I did buy something recently I'll show you that at the end of this video that I wanted to try it on my nails so I put a color on my nails today um, the next item is this wet n wild um, mega last filled of greens um, polish this I have a little bit of progress it's just there's a line from my last update and it's gone down just a tiny bit. I will mark this because you can tell that it has moved down a little bit. So I'm going to mark that one. Um, I did enjoy it. 
well I've told you guys this before I enjoy it on top of this blue one um, but I was I did start in the end putting on top of the pink one and I really enjoyed this combination with it kind of gave it like a like a natural like nudie kind of shade with the pink and the green if that makes any kind of sense or maybe more of a like earthy tone you know it looked really nice I thought so I'm um, sad that the pink one's done because it would have helped me get through this a lot faster um, but yeah the pink one's done and so the next one is this one this is in the shade I need a refreshment and I have no progress um, it's still at that same line there. I didn't use it at all, I don't think. Maybe once. Um, let's see. Okay, and that was it. That's it. I have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five polishes left in this project. I was going to add one more, but it was more of a summer shade, and I feel like fall's coming around so quickly. Um, Costco already has Halloween costumes, and I'm like, oh my god, fall's coming. So... I'm gonna wait till next month. Hopefully I finish up one more polish by next month and then I'll add in another polish and it'll probably be a fall color. Um, but I did make a couple of purchases I, I wanna mention because um, I am kind of excited about them. Um, first I found this Milani base coat at the, dollar, at the 99 cent store and this actually made the yellow go away from my nails. I put it on and then I polished them and the yellow was gone when I removed the nail polish. I was like, oh my god, it's making the yellow go away. So I don't know if they discontinued it because it was at the 99 cent store. But um, yeah, this works great. If you guys find this, um, pick it up and try it. It, it. it takes the yellow away. It's really good. Um, the next item I bought was I finally purchased some... Um, 100% um, pure acetone, but like I said, I've been so busy. I haven't even gotten to play with my nail polishes to even have to use this. So I got this at Walmart. It was like a dollar. I didn't know it was so cheap or else I would have put, bought it sooner. But yeah, I just got this little bottle at Walmart. Um, and the last thing I got, I got it yesterday and I'm so excited about it. Um, Pretty Crystal 89 talks about it on our channel all the time. It's the um, Shesh, Shesh Vite. Um, top coat and it's like a fast drying top coat and it made my nails like so shiny like I'm just like wow shine they shine a lot more this is the best top coat I've ever tried I just want to say that now um, I signed up with Sally Hansen's rewards the other day like a couple of weeks ago and it was only like 250 or three dollars um, they had some kind of deal going on, so I signed up with it because normally it's $5. And then they give you a $5 coupon back. So I used my $5 coupon on this. I only ended up paying like a dollar something for it. Um, so I thought that was a great deal. Usually they go on sale to buy one, get one free. Um, I don't know when that's going to be, but I did want to try this with that coupon before it expired. So I did use my coupon on it. Um, but yeah, I, oh my god, today was the first time I used it. I already love it. Um, it's that good. So you guys got to try this. Um, the Shesh Beat and the Milani um, base coat. Those were good. Um, but anyway, thank you for watching, you guys. Sorry I'm like rambling and talking really fast. But yeah, that's it. Thank you. Bye.